And Mr. McGregor pulled me aside, and this is true. He pulled me, I'll never forget the words. He said, you need to make, you need to make a decision whether you want to be a part of the academic class or a part of the class clown. I chose the academic. <laughs> But I, I'll never forget that, you know, and it's interesting, I graduated uh, 30 years ago this past June from here, and of course I'm here, back here every year for, we present bursaries every year, and it's interesting as I look out here tonight and see all the people, a lot of the folks that are parents now, and of course so am I, uh, that I went to school with, and it's very, uh, it brings back a lot of good memories of this school. I stood up here a long time ago doing uh, speeches for Students' Council, and uh, this was a fantastic school to go to, and one of the things that I found out, and it still is, you're right. Um, and one of the things I found out the other night when I was talking in the morning is that people think that I've already sent my kids to the Catholic school in Cornwall. Um, and I don't know where that came from, but my kids have been here. I've got three boys, uh, Adam's in grade 11, uh, Dean's in grade 10, and my son Ben is in grade 8 at uh, St. Mary's in Morseburg. Uh, and I don't know where it came from that I can't send my kids to Cornwall, but my kids are right here. So I can speak to this effectively tonight. Okay? I want to begin, first of all, by uh, thanking the organizers for asking me to speak. I wasn't sure what I'd say, and you know what? Uh, when I spoke the morning, she said, uh, just speak from the heart. So that's what I'm going to do, because Diane and I, as I say, we, we battled with this issue about three years ago when Adam started high school. Because the boys went to the Catholic school of Morseburg, which was a great experience for them. But then we had to decide, are we going to go to Cornwall with the kids, which said some of, the, some of their friends went to Cornwall, or are we going to go to Seaway? Um, Diane and I both went here, and uh, my comment to her, and I'm sure all of you will agree, if you're a good student, you'll be a good student in Seaway. If you're a bad student, it don't matter where they send you, you're not going to succeed. Right? If you're lazy, and I told my boy, this is my exact words to my boys. I said, if you're lazy, I don't care where you go, you're not going to be successful. And I think everybody can, uh, share, uh, can share that kind of same kind of thought. I know you could send the best student in the world to a school that's maybe they say, oh, well, that's a bad school or whatever, they'll still be successful. And if you send a lazy kid to a school where it's the best school in the world or, or touted as that, they're not going to be successful. So you know what? It, it comes from, it's got to come from you to be successful. And I see all these kids back here, and uh, it's wonderful to see them here tonight. Hunter Wells, I'm going to uh, uh, nominate you for an award for best cheer tonight. 